Investing in America, a new blog post titled America's Workers are the Real Winners from Corporate Tax Reform, hits back against critics who say that the new tax law only benefits corporations. It reads in part, companies will also use some of the gains from tax reform to return capital to investors. Money returned to shareholders of any kind recirculates throughout the economy with some helping finance new startups, some being reinvested in growing sectors of the economy, some being saved to increase future consumption. Let's bring in the writer of this blog post. He happens to be the former chief of staff under President Bush 43, Business Roundtable President and CEO Josh Bolton. Josh, you're preaching to the choir right here. I've been saying that. I understand the way that the tax reform works both for individuals and corporations. Are we hearing enough of that from members of the Republican Party and those very lawmakers really pushing back on the rhetoric from the likes of Nancy Pelosi? Yeah, I hope so. Uh, first of all, thanks for having me this morning um, to talk about this. The, uh, but I hope we are hearing it from the members who supported this tax bill because they, they have a lot to be proud of. Uh, it's not just the, uh, the dividends and share buybacks that the tax reform may release. The, the much more important part is the, uh, the benefits that are going directly to workers right now as a result of the extra cash that companies have. And even more important than that is the investment that those corporations, that companies all over America are going to be able to do right here in America as a result of a more competitive tax code. Well, I just want to point out we're looking at the vast list of companies that are returning some of the tax savings to their workers, whether it's in $1,000 bonuses. And we just found out Chipotle has said it's going to reinvest more than one-third of its savings from the new tax law in its employees. Some of the new benefits workers will get include one-time bonuses of up to $1,000 to hourly and salaried workers, along with life insurance, short-term disability insurance for hourly restaurant managers. This is just to name a few. But to look at a thousand dollars in this country and say that it's pathetic crumbs josh i don't I, I don't i i know that that does not resonate with the american people i've said this are people really looking at their bigger paychecks thinking i really wish nancy pelosi had her hands on this money instead of me uh, I, yeah uh, i hope they are and and comments like that i think just reflected a fundamental misunderstanding of what uh, tax reform was likely to bring, um, and the evidence is now overwhelming. At the at the business roundtable alone, we we represent 200 of America's biggest corporations. Uh, we have members of our uh, organization alone have already announced over 700 million dollars in bonuses to their employees, lots of wage increases, 401k enhancements. Mm -hmm. Uh, those are real substantial benefits for uh, the workers of all of those corporations, and that's just in the first six weeks after the enactment of tax reform. Um, I think there's a lot more to come in this economy, both in terms of short-term benefits that workers will realize, more importantly, in the long-term competitiveness of American companies, which is where American workers need to work. Josh, are you concerned, though, uh, about the tax reform being part of the reason that we were gonna, we're going to have higher inflation? You talk about wage growth, but wage growth is part of the inflation equation. You wind up with higher interest rates. That certainly last week was a, a big concern for the stock market with that wage growth number we got from the employment report. Yeah, that that could have been a part of what uh, what's roiled the markets a bit in the in the last few days is uh, an expectation now of some inflationary pressure from wage increases. But uh, but look, that's that's that ha well, wasn't the purpose of tax reform, and it's not it's not really going to be the effect. What everybody across the, uh, all political persuasions has been looking for is real wage increases for American workers. Tax reform is going to unleash uh, a lot of that. Um, and uh, overall, that's a huge benefit to the American economy. Josh, it was really good to see you. Thank you for being here. As Thanks always, for Josh Bolton.